Hi guys, I have a challenge for you today to review our 3D shapes. I'm going to challenge you to see how many 3D shapes you could build using things in your house. So I know we're not at school right now. I know we won't have our normal things. So we have to kind of be creative here. So I thought of some ideas that you might have at your house to try building with. And this is also just great for STEM practice too. So I thought for sticks, you can maybe use popsicle sticks that you might have at your house. You could cut straws apart. Um, we don't have toothpicks at our house, but if you had toothpicks, that would be a great thing to use. Or if all else fails, I bet your parents would love for you to go collect sticks in your yard. Little sticks broken up would be great for this too. And to get things to stick, um, I bet a lot of you probably have Play-Doh at your house. That would work if you have clay, awesome. If not, I was just looking in the cupboard, we have little marshmallows, so that we've used these a lot in school. So using mini marshmallows or even the big marshmallows would work. So I, the one I did, I made the cube and I used popsicle sticks and Play-Doh. And I know it's not perfectly straight, but it works. So remember you would start by making the base, make your 2D shape a square as the start and then just keep building from there. But see, can you make a cube? Can you make a rectangular prism try your best i attach posters under this link for um for you to look at as a resource but this is also something fun to do with uh your brothers or sisters if you have some see how many 3d shapes you can build today have fun bye